So before we go ahead and start today's episode, you guys, I would just like to give a big congratulations to the University of Iowa on a great start to the 2020 football season at a nice 0-2 record. Everyone, go ahead and give them a round of applause. Come on, come on. Let, let's hear it. Let's hear it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, obviously, Spencer Petras is playing incredible. I mean, I think he's a Heisman Trophy contender, not gonna lie. Stop the cap. <laughs> But um, also one thing to remember, Iowa fans, Rutgers has a better record than you. And yeah, go state, baby. Yo, what's going on, everyone? And welcome back to the channel. My name is Evan, and today we're hopping to another episode of Madden 21's No Money Spent, you guys. Um, honestly, it's just another game where I don't have an upgrade, uh, and we're just going to be playing head to head season. As you guys know, if you guys have been keeping... Uh, if you guys have been, you know, staying on track with the No Money Spent series, we have to win two straight games to make the playoffs, you guys. Um, and we've missed it every single season. So, this is the fifth season. We've missed it all four. So, it's it would be amazing if we can get there. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the team. Um, and that, my, my coin stack's pretty high right now. I'm going to end up getting a few guys here in the next few episodes. So, stay on the lookout for that. But uh, let me go ahead and show you guys the squad. Okay, I, I actually lied. As you can see, we have Kyle Ushak pulled up on the screen. Is this probably a waste of coins? Absolutely not. It's the man use check. Um, I'm just getting this base elite because, I don't know, I don't really have an upgrade. So I guess we do have an upgrade now. I didn't really plan on doing anything. But my, my coin stack has been sitting pretty high right now. And I low-key just, I wanted to get someone. So we're going to upgrade Kyle Ushak because he's he's been playing really good Um, when, like. With the fullback dives, like, he's he's come up clutch the last few episodes, like, when we need him. So, we go ahead and plug him um, into his power-up slot. And then, yeah, we got the man Juice Check upgraded to a 85 overall. He's going he's gonna to be a stud a stud fullback. And, yeah, I mean, I'm not going to get an X-Factor ability, but sure. We'll give it to him. But, uh, yeah, so just looking at the rest of the squad, though, you guys, we got the man Justin Herbert as our quarterback. Uh, running backs, we have Austin Eckler and David Montgomery. Look at the wide receivers, we have Alan Lazard, Stephon Diggs, and DK Metcalf. Uh, tight ends, we have Vernon Davis, Johnny Smith, and Hunter Henry. Looking at that offensive line, we have Lane Johnson, David Castro, Brandon Linder, Joe Thune, and Trent Williams, 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 and of course the newly upgraded Kyle Juszczyk. Defensively, you guys, uh, looking at that right end, we got Nick Bosa. Over on the left is Jack Youngblood. Defensive tackles are Leroy Glover and Linval Joseph. Cornerbacks, we have three acrobats. Uh, Denzel Ward, Byron Jones, and Antonio Cromartie. Looking at our safeties, we've got the man Darwin James. Uh, over at the free safety position, we have Minga Fitzpatrick and Xavier McKinney. Linebackers on the right side, we got Kenneth Murray. On the left, we got Patty Queen. Uh, and our middle linebackers, we got Ryan Chazier and the captain, Sam Mills. Uh, special teams, we got the man Andy Lee, Harrison Bucker, and yes, as you can see, we have Henry Ruggs now. Actually pulled his card out of one of the 85 plus things, so I'm going to end up probably powering down Tyree Kill. And when he gets a new card, sells power up because I don't really need to waste that 87 to 80 overall power up pass. So Henry Ruggs is now the new kick and punt returner. Um, but with that being said, you guys, let's go ahead and hop into a head to head seasons game. Yeah, I I'm going to keep on doing it. I mean, the last video, you guys, within 24 hours, the video, episode 41, had like over 200 views and I gained like 12 subs, which that's like the best I've ever done on a video in the No Way Spent series. So, if you guys are enjoying the content, make sure to go ahead and smash that like button for me because when you guys do that, it really does mean the uh, means the world to me. So, like I said, if you guys really are enjoying my content, please go ahead and hit that subscribe subscribe button because you got to be with that, that No Way Spent gang and come along for the journey. But uh, with that being said, you guys... Obviously a huge, huge game. Uh, let's go ahead and hop into a head-to-head -head season game. Hopping into the game, you guys. We are on the road in Mercedes-Benz Stadium. That's obviously my uh, my team. Looking at my opponent's team. He's got that new Dante Culpepper and Scary Terry. All right, this is going to be a challenge, but we, we got to win both games to make the playoffs. So uh, we got we got we got to keep it on. Got to keep. We got to keep. I cannot. I don't even know what I'm trying to say. We got to keep the. We got to get on a roll and keep it going. There we go. You guys, the No Money Spent Series tradition continues. We are on defense to start off yet another game, but he starts it off with a run to Barry Sanders for like 15 yards. So, 
I, I don't. I do not want to play a runner. I mean, if that's what I play, like I obviously have no choice. But I, w I would hope that like that it's not what could maybe take me out of the playoffs contention. But Darwin James stops Barry Sanders in the backfield. My opponent's still sticking in the I form formation. I'm gonna press my safeties. Hopefully someone can get penetration and he gets 10 yards again. You literally know this guy will run the ball all day when he calls a timeout because B Gary's Gary. Barry Sanders is gassed. Like, he called a timeout to get his stamina up. Guys, I don't I don't know what to do here. I'm gonna be honest with you. I do not know what to do here against this guy. I'm gonna have have to bring Derwin in the box. As that was not smart because he goes to the RPO screen pass for about 10 yards. I might have to switch over to the 3-4 formation for today as he goes back to the bubble. And Kenneth couldn't make the tackle. I played him in a flat and... Okay. Well, we got third and 14 here on our first possession, which is not at all what you want to see. Um, I think Diggs should be open. He does catch it. <sighs> I probably have to punt. It's, it's not, it, it's probably not the smartest move, but I really couldn't do anything against that guy's uh, offense, so I'm going for it. He is playing man coverage, so I am confident that Diggs can get open on the slant, as he should. He's not able to. I throw that thing over the top, and it's swatted away. All right. I can't lie, you guys. It, it just, it really sucks that, like, with me having to win two games to make the playoff, this is the guy that I'm facing, as Sanders breaks two tackles in the end zone. Offense is probably going to have to get points here. I mean, he went for two and he didn't get it, but, like, I, I just, I don't know. I, I'm really not confident in myself in this game. Like, I am, I'm already feeling like I don't have a shot. Just the way that he's moving the ball right now. Please catch this Vernon Davis. Thank you. He gets that slant. Hit with the back two. Keep going, Vernon Davis. Big time first down. Uh, we just got to try and see if my, uh, if my receiver's can get open, as I think Vernon Davis should get open on the corner route, and I guess that's somehow picked, although there's, I don't know how that jumped in, I'm gonna be honest, I have no idea how that was jumped in front of. I played the dime because I felt like he was gonna pass, but, and he does, I, sh I don't know why I bit that run so, f I just bit that run immediately, because he comes out in I form, and I, <sighs> like the fact that I'm playing this type of guy, and like, I feel like I have absolutely no shot because I, I I can't get any penetration from my defensive line whatsoever. Um, I, I I don't know. I have to start run committing. I don't think I got it off on that play, and it's another touchdown. Why am I playing this guy? Like why is this a like step in who dash? Why are you playing this way? It's Madden 21. Grow up. Like I'm sorry. If you guys are going to get annoyed with me complaining, go ahead. I don't care. This is just absolutely ridiculous. Like, this is just... It's... It's... It, it's, it's unreal. Alright, well, please catch it, Lazar. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We gotta find a way to stop the run. But I mean, yeah, like I, like I was trying to say, I'm just trying to find the formation that can allow me to find the best... Oh, nothing open. It's a huge sack, Jack Youngblood. We're calling this timeout. We might have a shot to get points. First stop, I feel like it's too late. Can you go for it, please? Can you please go for this, my guy? My wish is granted. My opponent is going for it here on 4th and 12. I mean, if he gets it, he gets it. He has 22 seconds, but if I can get a short field position... Oh, it would help me out so much. He's going to want that Texas route 100%. He goes to the flat. I'm not clicking on. Someone make the tackle. Darwin James, what a play. We got a shot to get points. Well, we didn't have anything on first down. I think I wasted a little bit too much time, but we do have nine seconds here. Um, oh, Eckler. Eckler on the Texas. Please get in the end zone. I, 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 uh, I have to go for the touchdown, don't I? All the way down the one. Huge play from Eckler. I'm going to the stretch. Like, there's no way I don't go for it. In this type of game... Like, down nine, I, I don't feel like... I should have went for the fullback dive. 100% should have chose fullback dive, but Austin Eckler, it doesn't matter. Walk-in touchdown. Somehow we're going to go into halftime, only down five points. We have momentum. I completely get it. I need to be punting this ball, and especially I'm doing a quarterback draw. It's really not the smartest thing in the world. That was a really stupid play call. If I was going to go for... I don't know what I was thinking. I'm going to be honest here. I don't really know what I was thinking. Defense is just going to have to... They're going to have to step up. I'm probably going to give up some points. By that, I mean a touchdown. 
Ah, it... Playing a runner, it sucks. I'm not gonna lie, like, being down 11, it's not bad. I mean, considering that he could be at, like, he could be 28-14 right now. Maybe even worse, I don't know. I feel like we're not in a terrible spot as... Diggs gets wide open on the slant. Please house this. Oh. Oh, he almost took it home. I'm pretty sure we're right back to where we would be um, if we didn't take that intentional grounding call, but I'm hoping he bites the dig. Okay, Lazard, please catch it. Alan Lazard, what a catch. That That is huge. It, I mean, if we don't get that, game's 100% over. So, big time player from Lazard. We're going to run hurry up inside zone here from the 12-yard line. Austin Eckler, working to the left side, breaks a tackle to the 5-yard line. Here we go, first and goal. Obviously, I don't want to waste too much time, but Austin Eckler cuts it back inside. He's stuffed there, still going to stick at the two-yard line. I'm trying to run hurry up. All right, it finally let me. I'm going to switch to the inside with a halfback dive. I'm going to try and quick snap him. If it lets me, as Austin Eckler got himself a big-time touchdown, I think we're probably going to have to go to two, for two points here as well. Going for the two-point try here. Um, I don't really like this touch pass play now that I see the guy's defense, but honestly, I don't care. I'm just going to send it. DK Metcalf, I think he's got the edge. And Deion Sanders rolls him in the end zone. We cut this thing down to three points. Man, if the defense can get off the field here, oh my god, it would be amazing. Third down and four. Going to watch the halfback route. I thought, Darwin James! Oh my god, please take this thing to house. Darwin James! He's housing this thing, and we have ourselves a lead. Oh my god, we are down 19, and we have a lead. This is- oh my god, you guys. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's go, baby. That was a absolutely huge, huge play from the defense. I didn't get what I- I didn't get my stuff set up. He's gonna have that crosser deep, probably. Yeah. I, I messed up earlier. Dang it. Yeah, I, I meant to hit, I meant to send my corners over top and actually send them underneath, but he goes back to the stretch run here. Just please don't let Barry Sanders break free. God, I, I, I cannot stop Barry. Defense just has to continue to play smart football. First and 10, he's passing out of the gun bunch. He goes over the middle. Dang. Like I said, he's continued to, uh, he's continuing to melt the clock. Once again, run committing to the left side. And the tackle is broken for a Barry Sanders touchdown. Well, we have 47 seconds and three timeouts, only needing a field goal here. Man, this is season on the line. Texas route wide open. Austin Eckler makes a cut to the right side of the field. 40 seconds remaining. We're going to call our first timeout. I would be lying to you right now if, uh, if my... I, ugh. I would be lying if I said my heart was not beating here. Alan Lazard, corner route, cooks him. Alan freaking Lazard. Nah, we're not taking this thing in the house. We're going to sit down right here. Let's go, boys. Oh, my God. Holy freaking crap, you guys. This is it. This is it. Season on the line. Austin Eckler to the left side. Into the end zone. Oh, my God. That's how you take a risk. Oh, my God. My heart is beating out of my chest right now. That was a gutsy play call. If I would have not gotten that and I had a touchdown I didn't take it, I would have been so upset with myself. But we are down to three seconds. He's running the Hail Mary glitch, but I know it. So I'm going to sit here with Derwin James. I know where he's looking, and it's not even close. We somehow pulled this thing off, you guys. I cannot believe we won this game. I was down 19 points and came all the way back to win against a guy who just ran stretch over and over and over and over and over again. You guys, that was the greatest comeback I've ever freaking had in my entire life. That was insane. I know I have some Falcons fans, especially the boy Joshua, but we just played the Falcons and he they blew a lead. It happens in Madden 2, you guys. Like, what? I mean, what? I, I don't know what to say. This was the most insane game ever, you guys. Obviously, next episode... Right now, our record is 6-3, and three, so we have one game to make the playoffs, and it's gonna be a fun. I, I just know it, but if you guys did enjoy today's video, make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button for me. Also, hit that subscribe button. Right next to that is that bell notification. Make sure to uh, hit that to be notified for all future No Money Spent episodes. With that being said, you guys, it's been your boy, and I'm out.
Peace out, you guys.